going to the Prado Museum and there we are going to split the group. Aquí estamos en Madrid, ya vamos a partir para Francia en el tren. No es tren, es ferrocarril. Ferrocarril. ¿Cómo? Entonces, adiós España, hasta la próxima vez que nos iremos a ver. Lo pasamos muy felices y muy tranquilos aquí, viendo todo lo que tiene o que ofrecer el país de España. Aquí nos encontramos en el Pero París 841. ¿Quién sabe dónde ir? Aquí nos encontramos en el país París. El país París. During the second revolution of July, 1830. So the only remainder looking like Notre Dame and lighted. But this thrilling experience will cost you about 250 US dollars per person. Oh, nice suggestion, right? I have many other ideas if you want. It's not really a tower, it's the building just in front of us. So don't look for a tower, okay? It's just the name of the restaurant, La Tour d'Argent. And on the left hand side, there is a statue of a lady. Well, she's not really a lady, she's a girl. Saint Genevieve. She is the patron saint of Paris. She. The city hall of one of the districts in Delphi. is already clean, it's built with limestone, white stone. <laughs> and of course, because of the pollution, it gets dark very often. That's why we need to clean it quite often. The problem is to clean the tower, it's easy because you use water with pressure and sand. But what you cannot do is just cover the statue. And if you use water... <laughs> Aquí, nos, aquí estamos aquí en el país de Francia, en Paris, en el Catedral Notre Dame.
Right-hand side, you can see Louis the Thirteenth, the statue giving his crown to the Virgin, and on the other side, you see. Uh, not really. You have to come closer because it's a church and there is another group. Well, that's okay. So I try as as, as loud as I can. All right. So on the left-hand side, you can see Louis the Fourteenth. So the three statues are named the Wish of Louis the. 13. You know, Louis XIII was a king of France, and the first duty of every king was to continue the dynasty, to have a boy. You know, in France, it's like in Spain, it's not like in England, only boy can continue the dynasty. Daughters are just a waste of money. As a result, we...
catedral que está dedicada a la señora. Notre Dame. So if you look on your language of education, and that's why they call the district, this is Paris Observatory. Very long time ago, before the world recognized the Greenwich Meridian, you know, GMT, the International Hour, so it was Paris Meridian and his wife. Marie Antoinette and about 1,300 other people have been beheaded. So if you look in the middle of the square, you can see an obelisk. It's written in the hieroglyph, Egyptian writing. So this is the gift of the Egyptian to thank the French for making excavation in Egypt in the 19th century. And you see there is a lot of Franks surrounding the obelisk because the 9th of June, the day before the soccer world cup opening we had a huge opening inauguration ceremony here this hotel named crayon hotel you see all the blue flag is and just after the crayon hotel there is a white building this is the american embassy i hope you will not have to go there <laughs> because the only reason you can you have to go there is if you lose your passport so we're going to the left, and you will see on the right-hand side, there is two statues on the right-hand side. Between those two statues, that's where the guillotine was. The King Louis XVI have been beheaded just right here on your right-hand side. So after the revolution, we had to change the name again to forget about all this blood, and that's why they call it Concord Square. And now this is there. So don't worry, we will see that much better because we're going to make a turn around. very famous for a 19th century French writer. In the second level, we have a restaurant, Jules Verne. So listen carefully. We're going to stay here until 11.30. Aquí estamos en el torre que ha hecho a París más famoso. Oh, holy moly, look at that fella. There's a carousel. Where's it where's it that thing? Maybe I'm blind. Oh watch him Hita. <laughs> Careful. Maritza, 
no te vas a caer. And uh, when we made the big ceremony of the 200 years anniversary of the French Revolution, we used 14 kilos, uh, like two, almost 30 pounds of gold to regild uh, this cupola. Aquí estamos en el hotel de París. Hello. Hello. Hola, Brown. Hello, Bucky. ¿Cómo le va? <laughs> Très bien. La basílica. Hey. Yeah. Que vamos a ir yeah. ahorita. Yeah. Vienen siendo las puertas de, de la basílica.
Here we are at Versailles. As you can see, everyone is cool. A bit cool. Christy. Christy. Yeah. Are you cold? Turn around. Are you cold? No, I feel great. The jacket. Yesterday we were sweating our petunias off. off. <laughs> Hello. Apartment. You see the building which has the shape of a letter U. As I told you before, we're going to see the king wing, go until the Hall of Mirrors, and go back by the queen wing. Inside Versailles. scaffoldings and lying on scaffolding making fresco painting directly on the ceiling. In France we have another system. We take canvas and we paint the canvas on the floor and afterward we stick it like a big puzzle piece by piece. And if you look here on your left hand side on the ceiling it's, you can see the mark of the glue. Normally you shouldn't see the, the connection but we need to make some restoration so with this ceiling you can get an idea how they make the ceiling. <coughs> what happened there? It was like white. Like cocktail lodge. So the things you see are visible. On the left hand side in front of you, you can see Louis XIV son who died before him. In this side is Louis XIV's grandson who also died before him. And on the right hand side is Louis XIV's great grandson, that's me, Louis the Louis XIV was married with a Spanish princess, Maria Theresa of Austria. And when the Spanish dynasty ends, the king of France, Louis XIV, sent his grandson Philippe V to Spain. And he started the dynasty in Europe. The first woman was the Fortean This woman was the what? Dynasty. So let me introduce you Louis XIV, the son of king.
so you see that there is like a moonlight <coughs> surrounding her. So don't forget that here it was first to have a lodge and maybe we can get in a little bit more to the chest so we can move on a little bit more. So uh, even after they lost the hunting lodge and they uh, using that the big royal residence, they continue to hunt. When you will be in the garden, you will see that behind the garden there is still an enormous forest. And the forest of today, it's only 10% of the forest with the 14 million people to hunt. And Diana was also the sister of Apollo in the mythology. That's why she's a very important girl. So here during the party, we're using this room as a building. But it's not the American building to build the table with balls. That's what we call pool. You play only two people with three balls. And of course, the one where we play, play against with a... OK, so this room is Mark's room. So during the daily life, we use this room as a guard room. That's why we painted the God of War on the TV. But during the party, we use this room as a music room. That's why you can see again on above the fireplace a portrait of the King David named R because of the comparison between Louis XIV and the famous musician King David. So the carpet is original. All the carpets you're going to see are original. They're about 300 years old and it's handmade with the loom. You know, when Louis XIV built Versailles, in one hand he wanted to leave a testimony to the future generation, but on the other hand he wanted to develop the French economy. That's why he decided to to stop to make any import. Every material which had been used to build Versailles was French. So before Versailles, we were making import from Middle East for carpets. So he built a special factory in the 17th century. The king of France was really married with rich princes. And the richest was who? The Spanish, because of the... And he was engaged to a Spanish princess too. But you remember, he's the great... Okay, so this room is Mercury room and it was the king bed chamber. So as I was telling you before, the king lived in public. So in fact, he woke up twice. He was really sleeping in the room which is behind this wall. You can see a door on your right hand side. And over there, every day at 8 o'clock, he had the little morning wake up. With only few people who have been admitted to attend the ceremony, one was giving the wig, the other one was giving the shirt. And then when he was dressed and ready, he was getting here for the great morning wake up. So look at the tapestry, you see the bed, he never used it. It was used just once after his death, before his burial, to uh, make sure that everyone would be able to see Louis XIV before the burial. You see the king seated with a hat with the further, receiving the Pope ambassador the one dressed in red, and behind you see the crowd, people are just like sardines. So why he was waking up twice? Because, again, he wanted to put the nobles under competition. If you were, were, if you were admitted in the middle of the crowd, in the great, you see, it's 300 years old and it's still working. The thing which is not working is those automats. You see, above the clock itself, you see doors. At the sharp hour, you had some doors getting in, in and out. So the piece of furniture remind you what we saw in the first room. Same um, material, ebony, turtle shell, gilded brass. The table is original. You have little samples of marbles. Here they use 144 different kinds of marbles. So the table is made of samples. Can you try to move on a little bit more? The rest we should speak loud. So, this is the throne room. That's why you can see um, the god of light, Apollo, on the ceiling, symbol of Louis XIV. So instead of this tapestry, we had a throne about three yards high. But of course, the throne was made of silver, and it had been stolen during the French Revolution. So we have no remain of the throne. The chimney is original. It's made of crystal. It's from Louis the 15th time. The carpet is also original. You can see again the sun. It has been made especially for this room to match the ceiling. <clears throat> and the two portraits we see here on your right hand side, it's Louis the 14th. Thank you. 
original such as the statue of Mary Antoinette. Here you can see the piece of furniture which was a jewel box which was also originally that had been given to Mary Antoinette two years before the French uh, Revolution. And the bed spread. So the bed spread was sold in auction during the French Revolution and we found it only after World War II. We bought it in New York in auction. And according to the model of the bed spread, we could restore the whole room. So the bed spread. Something Dodie. Dodie Fayed's That's father. the one she 
Here we are at the Opera House. Bonjour, mon ami de France. Mira los. <laughs> Aquí nos encontramos en el país de Francia. World Cup Stadium. Bonjour, mademoiselle. Comment allez-vous? Uh, yeah. Très bien. Très bien. Très bien. Très bien. Ah, huh? merci. Ah, merci. <laughs> Mexico. Oh yeah, U.S. too. <laughs> I'm gonna do a close up on her picture. You know, guys, I went to the uh, stadium today. I want you to You should put an American flag up there. You're like something about hard rock. Go that way. Hard rock. Oh, that's so mean. 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 Oh, that's so Hello, we are about to take a bus over. We're on the boat too. <laughs> In front of you is an example of a bridge adorned with sculptures in stone and bronze dating from 私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私
Jardin dessiné à l'italienne au XVIe siècle par Catherine de Médicis, à l'orée de la forêt du Rouvre. To port the Tuileries Garden. The garden was originally laid out in the Italian style in the 16th century by Catherine de Medici. Bad Port, Jardin des Tuileries. Im 16. Jahrhundert von Catharina von Medici angelegter Garten im italienischen Stil. Ah, Bad Port, the Jardin des Tuileries. Steuerbord, Musée d'Orsay. Der ehemalige Südbahnhof ist das Musée d'Orsay geworden. Er wurde restauriert, um zahlreiche Kunstwerke aus dem 19. Jahrhundert aufzunehmen. Ah, Tribune. Dal 200 Fortezza dei Re di Francia. Septième siècle est le siège des académies et de l'Institut. En amont du Pont des Arts, l'Hôtel de la Monnaie présente sa façade janséniste. To Starboard, the Ecole des Beaux-Arts, the School of Fine Arts and the Palais de l'Institut. The Palais des Nations, built by Laveau for Mazarin in the 17th century, is the seat of the academies of the Institute. Upriver, the Pont des Arts, the Hôtel de la Monnaie, the Mint, with its Jansenist façade. Steuerbord, Ecole des Beaux-Arts, Palais de l'Institut. The 17th century of Mazarin and the Institute is the seat of the Académie Française. Nach der Brücke Polisa, das Hotel de la Monnaie mit seiner jansenistischen Fassade. Atribor, zusammen mit dem Polis, der ältesten Universities in the days before knowledge became more widespread. Steuerbord, Stadtviertel Gartier Latin. Dieses Viertel hat lange Zeit die traditionellen Universitäten der Stadt beherbergt, bevor sie über die ganze Stadt verstreut wurden. Atribor, im Quartier Latin, Cuore Storico della Cultura Universitaria Francese. Vestibule de Bourgeois Latino, centro de las universidades tradicionales, que se realizaron de Paris, y sus primeros en cuanto a cero de las carreteras nacionales. Vemos la estatua del emperador europeo Carlomagno. En el subterráneo existen vestigios de cultos antiguos. Notre Dame en Paris, cathédrale symbolique de la période gothique avec chaque Anna et Reims construit. Jinnaïniwa Ongakka Kuplan no Organga no Kotteimas. A Tribord, place de l'hôtel de ville, un ancien port, la Grève, où la municipalité de Paris est née des échevins marchands de bombes. Devant, la place, lieu des exécutions capitales et des attroupements, d'où le mot Grève. To Starboard, the place de l'hôtel de ville, a former port, la Grève, where the river trading aldermen. A Tribord, a Tribord, a Tribord, l'hôtel Dieu, le plus ancien hôpital. To Port, Hotel Dieu, Paris's old age. On the bus, the Hotel Dieu, the hospital in the most antique of the Paris. The Hotel Dieu, 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 the Mordo in Luna, dietro al colonnato del Perrault, l'architetto del Seicento, le sale del più grande museo del mondo. Il trans la colonnata del Perrault del siglo XVII e il museo e la cultura. Giardin di Tuileri. Du palais, incendié lors de la commune en 1872, il ne reste aujourd'hui que le jardin conçu par Catherine de Médicis. En dépit de sculptures de Mayol, on travaille à la célèbre commune à l'échec du Canas, la tête de la France de Catherine à son Médici et le bord de la garde Manmade. C'est seulement 2h30, cette commune. Bonne après-midi. Oui. It's 9.24 here. La Torre y Diel. So there's seven hours difference? I don't know, this camera says 2.25. Say hi to somebody up there. Oh, 
This is where Diana died. Today we're at the Louvre Museum. Aquí se puede encontrar el famoso pintura Mona Lisa. Y muchísimo más. Pain in his version.
I just wanted to get a wedding.
size plus two. As you can tell, we're we're driving correct. All Americans are backwards. <laughs> See how everyone else drives. We're driving on the wrong side of the road here, or the opposite side of the road, shall I say? Not necessarily wrong. All the water. Pretty, pretty water. Okay, really. Here you go. Hey Christy, who are you wanting to see? Man singles, Kate Sampras. Sylvia number one. Number one? practicing here with them. Who are they back there? Here we are. 
Here we are at Piccadilly Circus. Everybody kind of standing around everywhere. Hey, what's your name? <laughs> Here we go, we're going to the famous Burger King, everyone knows that. <laughs> Make sure to pull me whenever we're going. There's a taxi. As you can see, there's like a million and one people here. Tells you which way to look <laughs> for traffic. We're here, I guess, where Diana used to live. It's pretty neat because this grass has like little bitty flowers. I mean, not that I'm a fan of flowers, but it's just pretty cool. Pretty nice scenery. It's a lot of tourists. It's supposed to be where Diana used to live. Where are you? Go! <laughs> Why is no one answering the door, Christy? <laughs> Kings and Team Palace. Again. Again. Westminster Abbey. Yeah. <laughs> What's that over here? I can't remember. 
That's Westminster, Westminster Abbey. It used to be a used to be a Catholic church. Since then, it's become a Episcopalian or Church of England. So the Protestant. Protestant referential. People protest. listening? Big Ben is ringing. Wow. We are now on our way to the changing of the guards at Bucky Dawn Palace. I mean Buckingham Palace. What is that? Stork. It's a pelican. That's why I have to wait here for them. Kyle, Jackson, what's through there? Huh? What's through there? Who are those dudes in the little black cats? Yeah. <laughs> Ah, I can see right here. Bucky, how does it feel when people stare at you? <laughs> Look at all the mice in the water. 
<laughs> Actually, like little dogs. They're baby bees. Christy, what are they? Here we are, fixing across the London Bridge. Marisa, come here. All right. Hey, this, we're at, uh, going to the London Bridge. Are we going to fall off? Probably. It's falling down? Knowing me, I probably will. I hope you're a good swimmer, Marisa. The bridge is falling. I wonder what that is out there. Enjoy this water, this water and this rain because... We'll get back to it's Texas. Home. It's going to be hot. There's Coach. Asking directions. Hello. <laughs> hey. Hey. <laughs> Take it, Marisa. <laughs> I can't. I don't know the words. You're eating a straw? Ooh. Yeah, I picked it up off the ground. Uh, We're here at the Tower of London. Everybody's beating me, so I've got to hurry up again. That's where we were at earlier. Wow. Look at the moat. It's about not even that tall. <laughs> what is that saying? Teaching Christy how to use the camcorder. <laughs> Zoom in. Zoom back out. Earth is kind of shaky. <laughs> <laughs> no, zoom into the, into the seal. Hey, 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 go back. You can see it all. Closer. You see the faces? Faces. Those are long heads. Cool. Earth is shaking me. <laughs> Jack the Ripper. She's not gonna say it. <laughs> now we're at St. Paul's Cathedral, right? Mm -hmm. uh, really? Really? It's <laughs> named after the famous car of here. 
Shit. <laughs> what the? Be <laughs> quiet. Paul Revere in the minute, man. <laughs> Hey, Bucky. Bucky. Oh, there she is. Hello. Okay, where are we at? Boston. Our trip is officially over. It's a long time to spend. It's not it. over until I'm like. Well, at least half of it until we're in Dallas. Buckster. Bucky. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> Uh, we just ended the Romeo tour. <laughs> There's good old Boston for Mr. Bradford H. Murphy. Wow. I'm really just easing up this film because I think it was taken care of. Huh? I said I'm really just using up this film. Tease it up on me. Here come the slower bunch. Wave! <laughs> Please proceed to doors. There's still yet Please even another wait. slower one. All other passengers, including yes. resident delias of the United States. Who are you? Please proceed to doors. Say hello. Hi. You're a little illegal. How what? did you cross the street? Huh? How did you swim? <laughs> Shut up. That is easy. She's high for now. Marisa? ¿Cómo te gustó tu primer viaje a la Europa? Es una pregunta. ¿Cómo? En español. En francés. Estoy bien. En inglés. Muy bien, muy bien. Hola. ¿Cómo estás? 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 No, it's just I'm a very deserving person because I work extremely hard. Not me, for my 2.1 GPA. She's the honest one. <laughs> okay.